few years ago, Henry was going to travel with us to Hong Kong. Every time we go for immigration and custom, he always get pulled over. And then we say, why? So, because he carried this expensive drink bottle with the metal he just bought. And every time trickle the x-ray. We tried to ask him, why don't you get rid of your drink bottle? But he was reluctantly to refuse it. But that was a good thing because that made me realize the good character of Henry. When he finds something good, something he likes, he won't let go. He hold on to it. So big days come. <laughs> Good on you, a bit of school there. <laughs> George, how are you? You'd be proud, wouldn't you? Very proud. <laughs> He's ready. How are you feeling, Fitz? Good. <laughs> so some of you may not know, but Henry and I actually first met at Hestie's house when Hestie was hosting pre-drinks before a friend's 21st party. When I arrived, Hestie introduced me to a guy called Swanee. And in my head, I made a mental note to go and speak to the very attractive Swanee later in the night. Eventually, I did. Little did I know that eight years later, it would lead to me standing here as his wife. And I remember when I arrived at the Jung's house for the first time, I drove up the street and parked in the driveway, and I sat there and I thought, shit, that's a very big house. But then I went inside and sat down with the Jungs and had a great dinner. And there was one memory I have from that night, and I think you'd understand after getting to know Silent a little bit better tonight, was him leaning over the, the bar at home and grabbing Nat's cheeks and squeezing them and saying, Henry, I'm very proud of my daughter. It's a fair indication that your son's been accepted into the family. I've got to say, when you walk into Silent and Janine's place, and there's a picture of Henry on the wall, you know. <laughs> Tristan, I haven't gone that far, you know. <laughs> well, I'll have to work on that. I still remember the day that you finished school. You catch a bus, you come to the apartment, help me do the painting. And a hot, boiling day in other days, she go down and help me to regraph a swimming pool. If I could do and change one thing, there's only one thing. I will turn back the clock so we could do it all over again. Oh my God. <laughs> so beautiful. Oh. Love you. Love you. But in the night journey, the challenge may come. You two hold each other tight, never let go. Together, nothing impossible. When you lead it, always remember, Baba will be here for you. I remember the first day we met. It's surreal to think that we spoke that night with no idea of the impact we'll have on each other's lives. 
Every day when I wake up, I'm excited to do life with you. You make me feel so loved. Since we've been together, there's never been a day where I have doubted your love for me or our relationship. Saying yes to you was the easiest and best decision of my life. You've taught me so much in the last eight years and they've, they've been the best years of my life. I can't imagine what we'll achieve together for the rest of our lives, but I know it'll be great and I know it'll be fun. My life is so much brighter with you in it. You have given me more happiness, love and support than I've ever dreamed was possible. I can't wait for our future together and I'm so excited that we get to share every moment of the rest of our lives together. And I promise to pinch myself every morning I wake up next to you. Nat, I'm a better man with you than I am without you. You're the love of my life and you will be as long as I shall live. <laughs>